Hi, I'm Sergeant Jack Poitras and I'm here today to talk to you about ATV safety. So first off, I want to touch on PPE or personal protective equipment. Although not required by law, wearing a helmet is always a smart idea when using all-terrain vehicles. As you can see, there are no roll cages on quads, so if you should tip over or come to a sudden stop and fall off, it's easy to bang your head on metal objects around you. While riding your ATVs, please keep in mind that speed is a major factor in severe injuries and fatalities. So while you're out, keep the speed down, especially on steep hills, in unknown terrain or in tall grass terrain. You never know if there's stumps in there or, or other debris that could make you lose control and flip one of these. These are rather heavy, they range from 400 to 900 pounds and when they land on you they cause serious injury and we have lost a lot of people while having fun out on the weekend on these uh, pieces of equipment so keep that in mind. You should always know your surrounding and what, we, what I mean by that is if you're going out for the weekend these machines will get you way out in the middle of nowhere and if you're going out there by yourself and nobody knows where you are and you get into some kind of trouble how are anybody supposed to find you so please if you're going out for the weekend let people know the area you might be and tell them when you're supposed to be back so that if you're not back on the day of or the next day at least uh, somebody knows where you went and we can come out and provide assistance well an atv or a utv are both motorized vehicles and if you're operating uh, piece of equipment under the influence of alcohol you can still be charged for impaired operation of a motor vehicle 